Today we bring you a very interesting Chinese folk belief how medicine leftovers on the street can help to cure diseases. Morning folks, this is Wicked Cuisine and today we want to introduce you to the custom of Yao Zha Zhe. Yao means medicine and Zha Zhe designates the leftovers you get after boiling herbs to make this medicine. When people fell ill in China, they traditionally boiled some herbs with special medical properties prescribed to them by their doctors. The Yao. These herbs are boiled in a special type of pot known as Sha Gua. Sha means sand and Gua means pot. It's a pot that is made with a mixture of clay and sand, hence the name. As a result, the surface is very rough. The Sha Gua is not only used to boil medicine, but also other types of soup. Once a specific Sha Gua has been used to boil medicine, however, traditionally it will only be used for this purpose from then on. The herbs are simply put into the water and the pot is then put onto the fire. When the medicine is ready, you need to separate the infusion from the herbs to be able to drink it. You can simply do this with a normal sieve. But a more interesting way that has also been used traditionally is to attach a paper flag to a sweet corn stalk and then hang the flag into the pot. The flag will restrict the opening of the pot so that only the infusion can flow out. So, now you can drink your medicine and hopefully you'll be feeling better soon. But what to do about the leftovers of the herbs? The Zha Zhe. Instead of simply throwing them away, an elaborate folk custom has developed around them. It was believed that these residues now contain the symptoms of your illness. And these symptoms need to be destroyed. Therefore, you cast them onto the street. Then they're already out of your house. And then you wait. Since they are on the street, people will be passing by, and carts and other vehicles. As each of them passes over the jarze, they will be ground finer and finer, until they are eventually gone. And when the leftovers are gone, so will your symptoms be. If you have to boil the medicine several times, you of course also throw the jarze to the street every time. As mentioned, this is a traditional folk belief that was very prevalent in the past. But these days more and more people come to regard it as mere superstition and don't do this anymore. Even if they still prepare the medicine in exactly the same way. In fact, we were quite lucky to stumble upon these Yao Jiaozi so that we could show this custom to you. And there you have it folks. This is the custom of Yao Jiaozi. If you like the video, give it a like. If you want to see one more video, click the button on the left. If you want to see a complete playlist, click the button on the right. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button in the center for more wicked culinary videos. We hope to see you in the next video. So long.